Hi, I'm Scott Dietrich, Offensive Coordinator at Parkview Baptist High School in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. And today I'm going to share with you the first in a series of videos featuring our combination triple option offense. And in this first video, we'll feature our base play, the play in which our offense is built around, which is the combination triple option and adjustments that we make off of that play. We'll also look at a few offensive basics and techniques that go into uh, perfecting this play. First thing I'd like to thank American Football Monthly for the opportunity to share this information in this series with you. Um, I know personally I've benefited from many of their fine resources and it's my hopes and wishes that you benefit from this information that I'm presenting to you as well. Um, at Parkview we've been running this offense for about nine years. Uh, during that time uh, I've also been a part of this offense 11 years. During that time we've been very very successful with this offense. It's been very productive for us. Uh, over a nine year period we've uh, been able to maintain a high level of consistency We've averaged about 35 points a game and well over 350 yards per game offensively. Also during that time, uh, we've won uh, 99 games and 18 losses. We've been to the playoffs all nine years. During that stretch, we've also been to the quarterfinal round of the playoffs seven out of the nine years, and we've also won two state championships, uh, the most recent being in 2007, which we were able to go 15-0. and 0. Uh, The offense has been very, very productive for us been able to maintain a high level of consistency and something I believe in personally as a coach. Uh, I wouldn't want to run any other offense. I've had the opportunity, like I said, to run about 11 years and it's something we greatly believe in. It's been very uh, good to us. Um, in running the, the uh, combination triple option offense, there are some things why we really like this offense. The first of which is I think it's a very unselfish, team-oriented offense. When you look at the nature of this offense, we're not asking any one player to win or lose the game for us on offense. We're looking at all 11 players doing their jobs and helping our team win. The other thing we like about it is uh, it really helps our team concept. We are a ball control offense. We try to uh, grind the football out. We'll take big plays when the opportunity presents itself. But more times than not, we're a time, uh, time of possession football team which really helps your defense. In this age of spread offenses, uh, we see a lot of teams with very good athletes that are trying to spread the field and exploit your athletes. So by keeping their offenses on the sideline, we really give ourselves the best chance to win. In this past season, we've averaged about 30 minutes of possession time out of 48 minutes. So it's pretty substantial in terms of keeping their offense off the field. The other reason we really like our offense is for personnel reasons. We feel like uh, we don't have to be great anywhere on offense when we, when we select personnel. We feel like um, you know, the, the positions and team, uh, things that we're asking our players to do, we can coach them to do. We're not asking them to be exceptional athletes. We also feel like it's easier to fit personnel into our offense. If you take, for example, uh, the slots, and we run out of a double slot formation, if you take, for example, our slots, it's easier to find the kids and ask them to do things that a slot back has to do compared to maybe a true tailback or true tight end, things of that nature. We also like this offense because of the way it makes the defense play. Defenses these days want 11 athletes on the field. They want to fly to the football, pursuit drills, and, and really, really take off where the ball goes. But when they come across an option team like us, they really have to slow themselves down. They have to account for the dive, the quarterback, and the pitch every single play, and that really makes them slow down and play differently than they like to play. The other thing is uh, we feel like it's hard to prepare 